We will practice Bhujanga Namaskar, which is very traditional sequence from the Hatha Yoga and to do the sun and moon salutation front of the mat. But now we one step back. Almost the middle of the mat, but almost the middle, but not the middle. A little, just a one step. Why is a one step? Because we have to do one posture, Uttan Asana. And then if we do the Uttan Asana from the front of the mat, we're going to do Cobra pose off the mat. So better we step back and then keep stay on the mat. Samastiti. So slowly inhale, raise our hands up from the side, palm facing down, turn your palm facing up, inhale, raise your hands up. Palm together, interlock your thumb, elbows together, slowly down to the Namaskar Sthiti. Namaskar Asana. Okay, elbows together, slowly come up. Interlock your finger and palm facing up, stretch maximum. And now Tadasana, heels up. Lift your heels up and contract your core muscle and try to stretch your spine maximum. Tadasana. Tada means palm tree. So this is the palm tree according to Hatha Yoga. So whenever we do the Tadasana, we stretch our spine, stretch our whole body part and heels together. Okay, keep breath normal, slowly heels down, palm together. Bend forward, Samkon Asana. And this is an angle pose, equal angle pose, Samkon Asana. Okay, make straight your spine, contract your core muscle, slowly inhale. Exhale, don't move your hip, just upper body turn to the right. Back to the center, inhale. Exhale, turn to the left. Inhale, back to the center. Exhale, slowly down. Grab your ankles, inhale, head up. Stretch your spine, exhale, bend forward. Pada Hastasana. Very good. So slowly inhale, head up, fingertips on the floor and stretch your body. This posture we call Uttan Asana. Uttan means stretching pose. So this is the stretching pose. Try to look forward. Keep breath normal. Inhale, exhale. Very nice. Now palms on the floor, knees on your armpit. Knees on your armpit and then slowly lean forward. So body weight on the fingers and just right leg up. Stay here. Keep breath normal. So we have three foundation. Right hand, left hand and the left leg on the floor. Right leg is up. Right foot is up. Okay. Try to find the balance and try to move your body weight on the hands, not on the leg, not on the left foot. Okay. So slowly step your right leg back. To the plank pose so once we get ready we are in the plank uthita chaturanga keep breath normal inhale exhale inhale exhale so slowly knee down chest and chin down guru namasakara asana very nice and then slowly hip down heels together Inhale, open your chest, open your shoulders, roll your shoulders back. Look up to the ceiling, cobra pose, bhujanga asana. Try to touch your heels together. If you cannot keep your feet together, feet apart. This is option. Should be feet together. Keep breath normal and bend your elbows a little bit. So your triceps start to work. If you make your hands extend like this, it's not going to helpful for your triceps muscle. So you have to act activate your triceps muscles in order to make your body healthy and stronger. Very nice. So slowly come down. Now tuck the toes and back to the mountain. Parvatasana. This is the first mountain in the Bhujanga Namaskar. So we need to keep our feet together. Inhale, exhale. So now right leg going to up. 
lift your right leg up and don't open your hip hip is square if you will open your hip then your leg will be go up so have to be hip is square yes very nice and inhale exhale knee to the nose don't lift your behind heel up heel on the floor so lift inhale up exhale knee to the nose one more time inhale leg up exhale bend your knees to the nose okay now keep it here lift your behind heel up move body forward ashwasan chalan asana so slowly step forward very nice so this is a different ashwasan chalan asana from the sun and moon salutation because we need to rest our wrist so wrist body weight on the front leg and now palm facing up wow to just to relax your wrist this is very important and keep breath normal all right so now bring your palms down knee down foot down inhale open your chest maximum open your chest maximum inhale exhale so slowly palms together anjani asana interlock your thumb and slowly come up keep breath normal okay then slowly back to the uthita chaturanga which is plank pose so now our right leg is done now we will start with the left leg processing so guru namaskar asana first knee chest chin down hip down bhujanga asana cobra pose roll your shoulders open your chest bend your knee, elbows look up keep breath normal and then slowly down tuck the toes back to the mountain feet together and now lift the left leg up hip is square don't open your hip yeah so slowly inhale exhale knee to the nose inhale leg up exhale knee to the nose contract your core muscle inhale straight your leg up exhale knee to the nose okay last time inhale kick back exhale knee to the nose and now lift your heels up and bow body forward ashwasan chalan asana horse riding pose now body weight on the front leg lift your palms facing up just to relax your wrist and then slowly come back knee down foot down inhale open your chest maximum exhale bend forward palms together interlock your thumb slowly anjani asana low lunge anjani asana keep breath normal slowly inhale exhale take your behind foot and now back to the uthita chaturanga which is plank pose once we done both leg now knee down chest and chin down guru namaskar asana and now slowly hip down heels together cobra pose bhujanga asana once we done bhujanga asana slowly come back tuck the toes back to the parvat asana mountain pose this is the last mountain in the sequence so we stay here a little longer keep breath normal if you feel tired then take a rest in the child pose activate your fingers and now chita asana lift your heels up twist your bend your knees out heels together hip up chest down look front chita asana okay then half a step forward and now both knees on our armpit so once we are here lean body forward and focus on the left foot step up so keep your left foot up and the right foot on the floor right now if you can do bakasana then you can try if you not feel comfortable then stay in the one leg bakasana eka pada bakasana 
Okay, now Pada Angustasan. So grab your both toes. Inhale, head up, look front. Exhale, elbows beside the elbows touch the leg. So we will stay here. Option, elbows out. Otherwise, try to keep elbows in. Stay here for a while. So slowly inhale, Uttanasan. So fingertips on the floor, stretch your spine. Keep breath normal. Both palms together, interlock your thumb. Slowly lift your hands up. Samkon Asan. Samkon means angle. So now, once we're done, so three Ekta Dasan. So slowly inhale, exhale, swing to the right. Exhale, back to the center. Inhale, exhale, swing to the left. Exhale, back to the center, keep breath normal, Tadasan. So interlock your finger, touch your head, palm facing up, stretch, and then heels going up. Stretch maximum. Palm tree pose, Tadasan. Okay, very good. So slowly, heels down, palm together, elbows together. Namaskar Asana, Namaste. Keep breath normal, inhale. Exhale, elbows together, slowly come up, inhale, palms open until your shoulder level. Turn your palms down to the Samasthiti.